Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by. And of course, you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another campground experiential video. In case, in case you're wondering, I'm talking to that camera too. I do, it, I do two different kinds of virtual tours now. That's the Insta360. So you can actually take your cell phone and see all around. Today, we're going to explore Arkansas Bend Park. That's a Travis County. Got to wait on a car. It's a Travis County and Lower Colorado River Authority campground on Lake Travis. So let me gear up and we'll go check out this beautiful little park. Get y'all seated on my head and in my face. We are northeast of Austin in the Texas Hill Country. It is June. We're still in the midst of a drought down in this part of Texas. And the lake is desperately low. And I, I mean, this is the lowest lake that I have seen in my travels here in Texas. We're going to go through the day use area first. And then we'll visit the camping, the campground loop. Breaking the law, breaking the law. I didn't see old stinking stop sign. This is the trailhead. They have, a, they have, they have quite a few hiking trails here. There's also an ADA compliant, a, a wheelchair friendly hiking trail. And I, I've done a, a video of that. So that, that video will be showing up here the next day or two. Make sure you click on subscribe and remember to hit that bell as well. So when those videos go live, you'll get notified. Breaking the law, breaking the law. I'm on the electric bike today because, man, I'm just having the world of trouble with my batteries on Sable. I don't know if my chargers are bad, but I can't get them to, the, the batteries to completely charge. So if y'all know anybody that's handy with batteries, Post a comment down below. I can use all the battery help I can get. Now there are two boat ramps here at Arkansas Bend, but both of them are closed because <laughs> well, you, you gotta go watch the experiential video to see. Because I, I, I walked down to the end of both of them. And this one in particular, I went all the way down trying to get on the courtesy dock. But yeah, I can't fly and I can't walk on water. So my boat ramp fans are going to be disappointed. They're both closed. So zip through the day use area. It's a really nice little day use area. Have a fantastic playground. Wait till you see that bad boy. It's a long way down to the water here. I actually made it out to that point over there. But I had to go down the boat ramp. 
Right, we'll just we'll loop through here so you can see what it looks like. Slow down because I sure don't want to drop off this edge. That's a, that, that would be a very painful experience. And I'm not willing to do that for you. I love y'all, but you know, man's got to have his limits. Head on over and see the camping loop. Keep your eyes open, there may be a deer or two. Notice there are no campground park hosts. Don't know why. Maybe they can't find anybody. So if you're looking for a host opportunity, might be just up your just what you're looking for. Before we get into the campground loop, I'm going to give you a look at the dump station. There's your dump station. We're going to go the wrong way so y'all can see into the sights. These are some very nice level campsites. They are all 30 and 50 amp water. There's no uh, sewer. We're gonna go all the way around and then we'll come back and do that. Bathrooms impeccable.
coming out on this street right here. There's Miss Trudy Thunder in all her glory. I think this is the biggest site, number 17. And you can put a big rig in there. You don't really have any sights with a great view. But you have some that have got some slope getting in. But most of them are pretty dang flat. Oh. It is Wednesday in June. Seems kind of strange that there'd only be three RVs. But what do I know? We will have to return to this campground at some point in the future because it appears that they are adding another camping loop. I haven't, I haven't had a conversation with anyone here about that, but there's lots of big trucks going by heading over there. sit right there all right I gotta get a hat it's hot I sure appreciate y'all riding along with me if you received some value some entertainment if you just like what I do please click on that thumbs up and blast me out across your social media that helps with the YouTube algorithm way more than you know and if you've not already and just so you know I do this kind these these videos for every campground that I visit on dudeRV.com, the second page, there's a Google map with layers. You click on a balloon, it'll open the YouTube videos for every campground that I have documented. That's your map. I've made that just for you. I know where they are, so I don't need the map. That's your map. So y'all go check that out. If you've not already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. And for those of you who have been following along, thank you. That's why I'm here. That's why, that's why I get to do what I do. It's, it's for you guys. If it wasn't for y'all, I, I wouldn't be doing this. So thank you for that opportunity. And for my patrons, thank you. We are so grateful for your support. <laughs> you guys rock! All right, y'all come back now, you hear?